On the second day of cooking, Skinny made a peanut butter chocolate fudge. Welcome to day two of Cookmas, or also known as Cooking with Skinny, episode twelve. Yeah, episode twelve. So today, as I I put it in the last in the inner title, my last video, that that was day one of Cookmas, which we made pepper and bark. Today's the second day of Christmas, and on the second day, we're going to make this beautiful chocolate, we're going to use this chocolate fudge icing, frosting, and this peanut butter to make a fudge. Now watch closely. We're going to melt this for a minute. Step one, melt the chocolate fudge in the microwave oven for approximately one minute. Simple. Turn that light off, Kenny. I'm technical difficulties. I think the lights are going out in the house. Not the whole house, but... The hallway. In one minute, I will pour that into this. It's Here, a mode. greased container. The food was provided today by Ruler Food. Simple, smart, fresh. Ruler foods. Even the soda pop I'm drinking was provided by Ruler. Uh, we're about 30 seconds in. You just pour it into the container. Now we're not going to put cherries in this one because, well... <laughs> this will taste like a peanut butter cup. Yeah. And it would taste kind of gross with cherries. Yeah, but if you do chocolate, you put cherries in. Yeah, but chocolate and peanut butter, you just, you wouldn't want cherries in that. Yep. I don't think. And just pour it in. Scrape it out. It's hot, hot, hot. Yeah, it does get warm. I think that's great good enough. Okay, put it down your placement. Now do your peanut butter the same way. One minute. Uno. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow in Cookmas. What are we doing on day three of Cookmas? I'm thinking rice crispy treats. Oh, they classic. We'll have to put some red and green sprinkles in there. That makes that them look Christmassy. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell swinging, jingle bell ring. <laughs> I didn't know we were getting a concert. Now the jingle hop has begun. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell swinging, jingle. Snowing and blowing up bushels of fun. In, In the, the frosty air. air. What a bright time. It's the, the right time. time. Horse sleigh, giddy up, jingle horse, pick up your feet. Just pour the peanut butter into the chocolate, <laughs> and then we will mix it but up. Now, but it won't come out, so I'm gonna melt it some more. No, use a spoon. So I'm gonna use a spoon. Just use your chocolate spoon. Yeah. Mm. This will taste like a peanut mm. butter cup. Mm-hmm. Somebody here at this table, not me, likes peanut butter. You can use honey peanut butter, you can use regular smooth peanut butter, you can use crunchy peanut butter, whatever kind you want. Just make sure you get it all out of there. And then we'll mix it together. Mm. The reason I'm putting them in the mashed now. Now, mix them together. You didn't shut the microwave door. Thank you. Ooh. Looking good. Smelling good. We need smell o vision, Kenny. I know. I saw that on a cartoon one time. In Scarfield. It looks like a peanut butter cup. 
smells like a peanut butter cup. This is probably what Reese's peanut butter cups are made out of. Well, they have powdered sugar in theirs, too. Yeah, we don't. We don't have any powdered sugar in this. So you got the containers scraped real good? Yeah. Got everything out of both containers? Yep. Yeah, okay, let's put it in the refrigerator and let it chill. We'll be back in a little bit and try it. Will we? Or should we just tell them it tastes good? It's up to you, but we have to let it harden up. Put it in the freezer, and then maybe we can have a taste test in a little bit. Yeah. But it is good. I mean, it smells really good. Uh, yeah, since that one smells so good, we'll have a taste test mm -hmm. that one. Okay, we'll be back in five ten minutes to taste test. See you then. Bye. We're going to try it now. So what do you think, Kenny? <laughs> Does it taste like a peanut butter cup? Good. Mm-hmm. I do not have enough words to describe the sensation that is going off in my mouth right now. Which is why we need other piece. We'll have to take them to the Christmas get-togethers, won't we? Yep. Yep. I mean, it literally tastes like somebody took a peanut butter cup and put it in the form of fudge. Which is amazing for peanut butter cup fans out there. It tastes just like a peanut butter cup. Well, that wraps up day two of Cookmas with Cooking with Kitty. Remember, you hit subscribe. Hit the bell for all our notifications. Be part of our notification squad. And remember, come back tomorrow for the third day of Cook Miss. On the third day of Cook Miss, Kenny Cook, the crowd.